Hi folks, Max from htc1root.com. Um, the Google Play edition is out for the HTC One. If you have AT&T, T-Mobile, Unlocked, International, um, you can go ahead and grab uh, this rooted version of Google Play edition. And uh, basically gives you the whole Google Play edition. Um, the thing with this one is it does come with an insecure kernel, which means uh, you'll be able to use root. Um, so definitely better option than unrooting back to uh, Google Play Edition stock ROM and uh, updating via OTA. Uh, also to install this ROM you will have to upgrade the radio. Um, to upgrade the radio you need to have S off uh, so you do have to get S off. I do have full instructions uh, step by step tutorial it is pretty easy to do to get S off um, so follow that guide get S off and once you're S off you can go ahead and install the uh, ROM and also install the radio which can be both a uh, flash using clock from recovery or twerp recovery. Um, I do recommend using actually clock from our recovery uh, 6.0.4.3 or higher. Uh, you may be able to use um, the latest twerp I think what is the version 2.6.3.3 uh, or higher also. Um, but let me give you a quick tour of what Android 4.4 looks like here, Google Play Edition. Um, a good thing about this one over other AOSP ROMs uh, mainly is that you get Beats Audio out of the box, uh, which is nice. And also, um, of course, with all KitKat ROMs, now you can use Wallet out of the box. Wallet works. Um, so you'll be able to use Wallet whether you have AT&T, T-Mobile, International, Unlocked. Um, also, should be coming to Sprint or Verizon uh, very soon. Uh, but in the meanwhile, uh, for those of you with at and Mobile, Unlocked, or Sprint, grab your Google Play Edition Android 4.4 here. Um, this one also does come with an advanced uh, Art, um, so you can run your whole phone in Art to access that. You'll have to go to About Phone, hit the build number a bunch of times, and then you'll be able to go to Developer Options, change this Dalvik to Art, and then Reboot. Um, so this is... Awesome, I guess. And also for camera, let me go ahead and show you. Um, you get the full Photosphere camera, uh, which is nice. And also the latest uh, Android 4.4 camera, uh, which doesn't add too much. Um, you will have to have a Nexus 5 to actually take advantage of the HDR Plus. Uh, but otherwise, Super SU working just fine. Um, you may have to update. There we go. Um, but it should work just fine after you install it just update it and there we go and I'm, I'm doing just fine um, so definitely check it out for this week's round week and if you do hold down uh, home button you'll get Google now here uh, okay Google I don't know how to activate on this one okay Google um, that's the only thing it should be working out of the box but there may be some additional settings you have to do to get, make the Google now and also Google cards is not showing up when you swipe to the right um, yeah but uh, you may be able to grab a Nexus 5 launcher uh, and enable that also but looking pretty good uh, I've actually used it last whole night uh, playing some Pandora browsing some web and I have fairly excellent uh, battery life so definitely check it out for this week's uh, ROM of the week again you need S off and also you do need a clock from my recovery 6.0.4.3 or higher, which I also have on my site, or twerp 2.6.3.3 or higher. You can also update twerp using Goo Manager and clock from my recovery using a ROM Manager app from the Play Store. And yeah, do let me know what you think. That's the ROM of the week, Android 4.4 Google Play Edition. This is the latest KRT 16S. Um, so you will have a lot of fun with it. And uh, I'll see you guys soon. As always, if you have an ACC1, don't forget to sign up for my email list at uh, acc1root.com. We update you once a week with Round the Week tips, hacks, and more. And thanks guys for watching my video. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and the subscribe button below here uh, to get more cool ROM reviews, tips, tricks, and more. And also check out video of the week over here if you haven't yet. And as always, uh, stay on Android.